This is Coogan Precious Rifle TV with the Copper Box here at the Rock the Box 3. With me I've got Huey Fury and Peter Fury. Huey, very impressive second round destruction of Matthew Greer. Yeah, it was just, uh, just doing the job properly. Just uh, first round, just taking it easy behind me jab. And just keep uh, thinking with the combinations in the second round. Dad said, up your game a bit, just take it calm and steady and just work your finger. You'll get him out there. So. Mm. I'm just done by my dad's uh, directions and that's what happened. Peter, did you, did you think why was Murphy Gray kept getting up as well? He's, you know, he took some, took some punishment early on. Well, we've had a look at him, you know, he's, he's, he's a game journeyman, you know, he's uh, watched most of all of his fights, he does try. When he gets it, he doesn't pack it. But um, I was expecting him, even in the second round when he got dropped, I thought he was going to get up, keep fighting on. I wasn't expecting it to end so quick. But mm. the, the shots he was hitting him with was only a matter of uh, time. You know? mm. It took me back the first time he went down, that was a body shot, wasn't it? Yeah, the first time he just went down and just uh, hit him underneath the midsection in the temple and stomach and that's it, just picking me shots. Mm. And that's just give him around the side and just open your shots and let him go. Were you surprised he kept getting up or...? No, I knew he was going to uh, get up because he's like his dad said, he's a tough uh, journeyman so... And like he fought uh, Deontay Wilder in his 27 fights, only three fights ago. Mm. Look at him, he's uh, how old is he? 27, whatever. I'm only 19 year old, mm. just stepping up my game. First fight of uh, 2014 for Huey, so all good. So you're just going to move me along like you were last year? Well, you know, it's good, you know, we've had a lot of criticisms. Can he punch, can he this, can he that? You know, a young kid at 18, he's coming into his own, still hasn't reached his man strength yet. But look at his weight, 17 stone 9. He's a big, big heavyweight mm. and he can fight. So we're going to see, it's a promising start and on we go. He's got a lot more to do, a lot more to learn. And we're just, this is his 13th fight, eight stoppages. So roll on to the first of match. Uh, just talking about the finishing shot, it was a right hand, wasn't it, that finally got yeah, him out of there? Yeah, just a right hand over the top, just stunned him and that was it, he was out of there. Okay. I knew he wasn't going to get from that one. Do you think he could be fighting for a British title this year? I'm not concentrating on titles, but we are up in his game this year, you know, looking at decent opposition. You know, if he's getting the likes of Matt Greer out of there, he's been in with Kevin Johnson, he took six rounds of Dennis Boyce off. You know, he's been in with all the, all the, the top ten really. So basically we need to start looking up, step up the opposition and we will be doing it. Well, do you want to shout out anyone, Huey? No, nope. like I say, I always say I respect all the fighters and uh, whoever I fight next, uh, I know I'm going to win. I so, can't admit, do you want to thank anyone? That's what I should have said, sorry. Oh, thank. Yeah, I'd like to thank uh, my dad especially and uh, everyone who's helped me out and all my fans who uh, come to support me and that's it. So uh, yeah, I've got to thank my mum as well, so <laughs> put a cock in everything. You thought I was asking if you want to call anyone out, didn't you? He did say that. No, I said, do you want to shout anyone out? You know, yeah. big them up. <laughs> Could have got some gold there for you. Yeah, right, listen, thanks for so. talking to IFL You're TV welcome. and well done. All right. Thank you.